What do you mean by the term static error coefficients of a control system? Well, my name is Rishi Ramju and welcome to the Backbench Engineering community where I make engineering easy for you. So, let us ask ourselves that obvious question. What do you actually mean by the term static error coefficients or static error constants of a control system? Well, let's run out. So, static error coefficients or static error constants, they are basically figures of merit of a control system. Figures of merit means that they are just numerical parameters which are used for the purpose of representing the performance or the efficiency of a particular control system. So that is simply what you refer to as static error coefficient. So the higher the value of these constants, the smaller is the value of the steady state error of that particular control system. So there are basically three types of static error constants. Positional error constant, velocity error constant, and acceleration error constant. So what are these three constants? Well, let's find out. So first we have the positional error constant. So the positional error constant is given as Kp is equal to limit s tends to 0 g of s multiplied by h of s. This is the value of the positional error constant. Next we have what you refer to as the velocity error constant. The velocity error constant is represented by kv which is given as kv is equal to limit s tends to 0 s into g of s multiplied by h of s. So this is the value of the velocity error constant. And finally we have the acceleration error constant. And this acceleration error constant is represented by Ka and it is given as K is equal to limit s tends to 0 s squared multiplied by g of s multiplied by h of s. This is the value of the acceleration error constant. So these thus are the three static error coefficients or static error constants in the case of a particular control system. So we need to know these three static error constants because in the upcoming concepts, in the upcoming topics, we'll be using this a lot. So that's why we must know what I refer to as the three main static error constants. The positional error constant, the velocity error constant and the acceleration error constant. This thus is simply what I refer to as the static error constants or static error coefficients of a control system. As simple as that guys, there's nothing more to it. So I hope you guys now have clear understanding of what I refer to as static error coefficients of a control system. And if you guys found this video informative, please do hit the like button and join this community by hitting that subscribe button. We'll be discussing about the further topics in the upcoming videos. So stay tuned, stay subscribed and till next time, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you.